Hey guys, my name is Kunal. Welcome back. And today, this is a full review of my motorhome. It is based on a, a Mercedes motorhome and Volkner Mobile Performance S. So then, it's kind of a tough name, but so uh, let's begin with the review. So now, once you have taken the full 360 view, let's begin with the tool. So first, when you enter, you need a door. You get in the door, and now you have some staircase leading up to the driver's seat and to the main motor home itself. Let me open the roof. So once the roof is open, these are the roof. These are green uh, smooth pieces pretending to be roofs so let's, we, let's take a look in so can you move this for a better look at the motor room when you enter here when you enter in, in here you can see there's a staircase leading up this is the staircase then here this is the driver's seat, so you need to put it here. Now you have a driver's seat. Okay, you come up to go in the motorhome itself. So when you come here, you can climb up here to get a view into the kitchen and a flat screen TV. Then once you go through this small gap, you can come to the bedroom with a cape. So then this is when you, you know, uh, go on the road, you're moving on the road. So when you stop and you actually want to see proper TV and you need to want space, this just comes out and then when there is roof, it stands straight. Okay, so this comes out. Now you have space for a seat and a TV and lots of space to work and uh, lots of space to enter into the bedroom. Okay, so once you are done like that, so now you have inner space. This is slide out. If you want a tutorial on that, please comment down below. And there is one more feature when you remove this front uh, glass windshield. You can flip over the driver's seat. Okay, you can flip over the driver's seat to get into the engine compartment as you can see there is an engine right there i use that in my convertible too if you want to go if you want to see my convertible you can go check out the villa amazi video in that i have given lots of extra stuff so then this was the tour of the inside but that's just the inside there is a whole lot more to the exterior of the uh, motorhome not only a opening door to enter in there is a whole lot more now I put my camera stand now you can see this thing it's, it's like a big pan it's not at the other side but then it is on this side what does it do it is actually you can flip this up now you find a storage area and what is this i see some tires so you flip this down to enter in a garage oh yes this motor home has a garage in it with a small little jeep it's very cute and small you can it is not mini fixed scale but so if you don't want to have a jeep okay you want to camp somewhere out like a camper van you don't have this rolling out thingy so you have this platform 
can take some seat and then put it in the platform here okay take lots more seats and you can put it in the platform you have extra space you can keep some grills in there if you want you can put a, you can put a swimming pool if you want a small little hot tub or something there there's lots of space and you can do whatever you want not only a garage and if you don't want the storage space you can just use it as something else and then it's better i use it as a garage because then this comes down as a ramp and then that allows this car to go in and it goes in there as you can see then you can close this up then you can close this down so then this is my uh, motorhome hope you liked it but then there is something more not only a motorhome this is something big this is the world's longest chopper you cannot even capture it in the camera this is how long it is if i connect it if i keep this is how long my tile is okay this is how long my tile is and if i keep it like this at the edge and then this is how long it is it's even longer than the tile this is the world's longest chopper Okay, hope you like these both creations. Please like, subscribe and uh, take care. Bye.